Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. Long time no see, I know. <laughs> I'm sending you greetings from beautiful Florida. And um, today's topic is about numbers and reoccurring number patterns. I'm sure a lot of you have already had some experiences with um, numbers that seemingly seem to follow you wherever you go, wherever you look. Certain number patterns when you're out. You see them on houses, on magazines, on book covers, wherever you look, this certain number or certain pattern seems to follow you. This, of course, as you can imagine, is no coincidence. It's just one of the ways that the spirit world likes to connect with you and likes to send you messages. It's just one of those really subtle ways in which they try to get your attention, which through numbers, obviously enough, is, is quite, quite odd and uh, works because it'll get our attention. So if, you, if you've noticed that these numbers follow you around and you, you just can't make any sense of it, I suggest you try and make, make a personal connection. Maybe you get into numerology, find your own life number, your own destiny number, which is actually the sum of every single number in your birth date. So if we talk about, let's say, the birth date of the 1st of May 1984. So you'll be adding 1 plus 0 plus 5 plus 1 plus 9 plus 8 plus 4. And the sum of that will be... 28, you add these two numbers as well, which is 2 and 8, which is 10. Again, 10 is a two-number digit, so you'll be adding 1 and 0. So what comes out as the um, destiny, as the life number, is the number 1. And there are certain qualities and certain messages connected with each and every life number that we have. There are always one-digit numbers, these life numbers, so you just add them all up until you have one digit left. And I suggest that you delve into this topic, find out what your personal life number is, if you don't know it yet. Also try and make a connection with the numbers that you keep seeing. For example, if you keep seeing the number 11, try and make a connection whether it's the month of November or the 11th day of the month or something similar which has a personal connection with you. And that's the beautiful thing about it. The spirit world never really encodes these numbers and these messages in the way that you won't be able to decipher it. They never do it like that. It's always meant for you to get the message. So I suggest try and do a bit more thinking and try and find out what this personal connection with you, your life or your loved ones, whatever is important in your life, whoever is important in your life, and make that connection. Often it's the case that the spirit world likes to give you signs, give you small signs that yes, they're seeing you. Yes, they see your efforts maybe in your early stages of dealing and, and reading up on uh, spirituality, on magic. It's often the case that um, people who are new to these topics, to these subjects and to these whole new realms who open up to that get signs from the spirit world that yes they are there they're watching and they're there to support you and they're also very keen on conveying messages to you and these often occur at the beginning as numbers if you're not able yet to perceive them as whole packages of information or as images or something like that because the spirit world has many many ways of communicating with you numbers is but one of many means that they like to use so don't try to ignore these reoccurring numbers if if they got your attention and they're there for a reason they were sent to you and finding out your own life number getting a bit into numerology and trying to make the personal connection and bridging each number to a certain maybe incident, month, time, whatever this number could mean to you, will make it easier for you to find out what it is that this number wants to tell you. So, wishing you a lot of success deciphering your personal number message. And if you'd like to, you can leave your experiences with numbers in the comments below. 
Thanks for watching. I'll speak to you next time. Bye.